fast cars and explosives. These are things that are obviously dangerous. But what about products that at first glance seem completely harmless, like hair care products, underwear and cooking oil? Just how dangerous are they, really? We're going to dress these mannequins with these underpants to find out just which is Britain's most dangerous. OK, Brainiacs, get the keks on. This is a pair of Grandad's 100% cotton Y-fronts. No self-respecting man under the age of 55 should be seen wearing anything like this. The second type is a pair of satin boxer shorts, normally found on a man who thinks he's as sexy as he was 10 years ago. This third pair is a pair of pure polyester briefs, for some appealing because they come in packs of six, but actually pack no sex appeal at all. And finally, the classic novelty underpants. The less said about these, the better. And yes, you know who you are. The way this experiment will work is by attaching this slow-burning ignition cord to the underpants. The cord will then be lit and we'll see which pet is the first to go up in smoke. OK, is everybody clear? Stand back. Three, two, one. Ignition. <laughs> Great balls of fire! Man-made fibres such as nylon and polyester are created from petroleum-based molecules. They tend to burn more easily than natural fibres, which is bad news for our monkey. The cotton is surviving well, and it's only the mannequin that is actually burning. It's much the same with the silk boxes. The polyester pants, however, have performed poorly. But our monkey and his nuts have been well and truly roasted. Great balls of fire! So there you have it. Britain's most dangerous pair of underpants is the monkey. And just remember, next time you're out shopping for briefs, the old barbecue rule. A burnt sausage is no good to anyone.